Odom kicks to Mack. That's a war. And he uses the glass on the layup. Well, Greg, you said a moment ago, Louisville, a team that can get up and down the floor with great ease on both ends. They like to be Clark the aggressor in every situation. Well, Kevin, you're right. They've always been able to recruit tremendous talent. Not only skilled, but athletic players, too. And it's hard to think of a Louisville team that doesn't get up and down quickly. That was just a perfect possession, getting it in tight for the high percentage shot. Odom kicks to White. Back to Odom. This is his first trip to the line tonight. On the free throw, no good. Well, guys, for Louisville in the last decade or so, it's been a bit of a... And the first half comes to a... Like I was going to sit there and have these fuck niggas be... Nah. <sighs> but I'm messing up. I need to take better percentage shots. 57%. And we welcome you back to college basketball here on 2K Sports as we get ready to get going for the second half of play. Guys, we had a tight game through the first half. I think we'll see more of the same coming out of the break. And it's just going to take one big run for one of these teams to establish control. If we can get hot, this team has a great chance of coming away with the victory. Green, he's in a point guard. Also Duncan out there, and it's Oubre in at the three. He hits the second from the line. Boy, some really big names have come out of the Kansas Jayhawks program into the NBA. A pair of first overall picks in their history. Believe it or not, Wilt Chamberlain wasn't one of them. On the court right now for the Cardinals. Rozier is out there with Sanders. Then there's Harrell. Then it's White. And it's Mack in at the five, roaming the paint. You know, sometimes you can see how a player can lead on the floor from the sidelines. And you see that with Freak. I mean, he's got the skills and athleticism as a point guard in addition to the leadership, too. And, guys, people often underestimate just how important leadership is. You know, there's no stat for that. But guys like Chris Paul and Steph Curry have incredible skill, but their leadership on the floor is equally as important. Freak is a floor general in their mold. Well, on the top of the oh, come on. draft was under that territorial right, which was why he wasn't first overall. But if you add him to the list, that would make three total Jayhawks taken number one, Greg. Yeah, along with Danny Manning and, and also Andrew Wiggins being the overall number one selection. I mean, the Jayhawks have had a ton of talent, though, in the lottery Thank over the, the course of their history. This, this school has produced just tremendous talent <coughs> in, in year I need like to do Paul better. Here's the screen. And White kicks to Sanders. And here we go. The Jayhawks with a fast break. Green leading the charge. Rebound really, nigga. Harrell. Really, Harrell's nigga. Got his third rebound on the night. That's something they need to do more of. Get after it on the glass. Go get those boys. Clark, it wouldn't hurt. Some extra possessions would definitely help narrow the gap and maybe swing the momentum. Now here's White. Seven points in the game. And the three off target. Pass to Gaines. Back to Green. The three. The basket is good. The assist from Gaines. 14 points for Freak. A okay, so I did a three. lot of um, off-camera, like, Rozier, the pass to learning Sanders. of my character. Here's the pick. Just to figure out. White with it. Now okay. defended by Oubre. Here's Harry. Hmm. All right, so just to figure out what his sweet zones are so I can, like, be able to perform the best when it comes to these type of things. And that was one of them when it comes to, like, three-point range. Outside, White. To the right side. Some nice passing by Louisville here. 
Passes it to Sanders. Here's Rozier. Down to five on the shot clock. They double him with Green. Harrell kicks to White. That one's off. Still out of sync. And yeah, you see a lot of players who are very talented play with a me-first approach. That is not the case with Freak. He doesn't try and attract any unnecessary attention and just focuses on playing his game. Yeah, I like that about him, Greg. I mean, hey, he look like my homie Joe Ball. Most guys are self-centered, and it's all about me. It's refreshing for a player Damn. like Freak who doesn't invite that kind of noise. I mean, I mean they're sitting there talking about how so. I'm not Green. all about me, but I've been, <laughs> I've been doing it the whole game. Wow, this game just a commanding performance for Green. 15 yeah, points, and he's been a good on-the-ball defender, too. He's got a pair of steals. Yeah, he's just made a lot of very heads-up plays, and his defense really has been a difference maker. And it's a completely new group for the Cardinals. Here's Hughes. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. Yeah, good job to take it right at the deep. Yeah, really left him no choice there, Greg. He had the foul and keep him from converting the easy bucket. Jenkins, he's checked in for Green. Uh, no fuck, nigga. Oh, what the Google hell? Also making some changes. Jones comes in for Thomas. And it's Rogier in for Russell. Damn. Second shot opportunity. Go crazy. To the line. It could be a three points. And for Will. Peyton, he's checked in for early. And it's Rogier in for Russell. They double him with Green. Here's Jones. Another miss. And they've really hit a rough patch here. Just too much of a deficit to overcome. Just not enough clicks and ticks left on that clock in this one, Greg. No good from Duncan. Money! Like oh, that. and that cuts the lead to just five. And the defense Full court. Just gets caught standing around that time and giving up the second chance opportunity. You know, that just can't happen. They need much more effort than that on the glass. And the Cardinals make it a change here. And now we've got the intentional foul. Really, nigga? 19 seconds left to play here in the second half. Wait, why isn't it? Why isn't it let me intentionally? Started by Green and the foul. Like, like, why was it let me intentionally foul? I should learn these controls. Voice commands. Hmm. His first foul of the game were in the single Wow, pass. they changed these controls for no fucking reason. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a seven-point game. The free throws go down and the lead goes up. From downtown, cannot hit. And so they foul intentionally. And you can see where they're coming from. By like, this is the end of the game. Block, like, in, co game in college. Over. Yeah, exactly. I mean, this game is over, and they're the only ones who don't realize that. So we see the Cardinals get the win here. <sighs> that played terribly there, you Yeah, I saw my draft potential going down with that game. Told you, high school, I'm raw. College, I'm huff as hell.
everyone, and welcome to this broadcast of College Basketball on 2K Sports. The action doesn't get much better than two of the most dynamic teams in college basketball. Going at it on the hardwood. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. We've got the Kansas Jayhawks facing Villanova. And the thing you love about collegiate sports, the passion, the energy, I mean, the competitiveness and that hunger and drive to succeed and, and show what you have. It's really always a marvel to watch. No doubt about it, Greg. And seeing these players out here tonight, I remember how the love for the game of basketball in those formative years when I was playing college was so invaluable. I mean, the experience you gain with excellent coaching and mentorship at this level, really a huge part of where you go with your talent. So let's take a look at the starters for the Kansas Jayhawks. Green in at point guard. Also Duncan out there. And it's Oubre in at the three, the small forward. Now here's Green. Lock at six. And good. And it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. You know, so often we can forget that these players are student athletes. I mean, Freak does not have that problem. He's an amazing student off the floor and is very dedicated in the classroom. And how about Freak with a 4.0 GPA, an honor student in high school, and has carried that same work ethic to college as well as he prepares for his games. He truly embodies what it means to be a student athlete. And Kansas always seems to be in title contention. I mean, the program does a great job of finding tough players and having a system that fits them best. Rarely are they not a title contender. Man, can you always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass? Money. Pass to Cooper. Cloak loose. No good. And Kansas the other way now. the wing green he's covered by Beal. green no luck well i think the defense got lucky right there i mean he's gonna make a lot more of those than he misses when he's got that much room cooper a screen on green now miller soft touch off the glass on defense villanova Outside, Green. Nice jump shot from the top of the key. Green's got his second bucket of the night. Green's gone two or three from the floor. Beal, the pass to Cooper. That's tipped. And here we go. The Jayhawks with a fast break. Green with the ball. They get the rebound. Another shot. It's up and it's off the mark. He's 0 for 1. Really, nigga. Beal with it. Outside Bryant. And it's Miller. It's off the key. Beal from long range. No good. So on the floor for Villanova. They've got Bryant. Miller is out there with Cooper. And it's Beal in at the point guard. Really, nigga? And the Villanova Wildcats have had a recent surge in their program over the past decade. Since about 05, they have been a consistent presence in the tournament and also have won a few conference titles. Villanova going with a whole new group out there. 106 left in the first half. On the Wildcats, so Villanova have been getting back in the swing of things as a program over the last decade, Clark. And one of the better runs they're on right now is a school. Yeah, they are a surefire bet to pretty much be in the tournament almost every year now. Really one of the big schools in recruiting on the East Coast. And here's Green outside, and he gets it to go. 